And so this form of innovation, this obscure, this, this deceptive innovation is known in our time and its manifestation in our time is Al-Hizbiya. Hizbiya, the partisanship and clinging to certain leaders, certain rumours, certain so-called scholars and certain speakers, certain groups and parties. This hizbiya is something that is dispraised in the book of Allah and in the sunnah of his messenger, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, and upon the tongues of the salaf of this ummah. For it leads to this splitting and this division that is present within the ummah. And that, brothers and sisters, then, it is important that we understand some of its signs and some of its alamat and some of its characteristics that we, too, may be acquainted with it. From its characteristics, brothers and sisters, is that this affair of his beer, this group partisanship and affiliation to something other than the truth, something that resembles the truth, principles and qawaid, that resemble the principles of the people of truth has sifat and has manifestations. From the greatest of its manifestations, of course, is at tafarruq al furqa fi deen Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, splitting and dividing the ummah of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Those who affiliate themselves to these varying groups and parties that resemble the people of truth, when this individual affiliates himself to a group and he has no concern, except with that group, except with that party, except with their meetings, except with the writings of their leaders, except with the works of their thinkers, and they split away and separate themselves from the book of Allah and from the sunnah of his messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And that is not in completion because of course they will claim to follow verses of the book of Allah. They will read the Quran and the sunnah, na'am. But when they separate themselves from the Qur'an and the Sunnah and the principles of the Qur'an and the Sunnah in that which they practice, whether they realize it or not, then those who do so have formed a split in this Ummah. Whether it is five individuals or five thousand. That is a split. Since it splits away from the book and from the Sunnah and from the way of the Sahaba Ridwan Allah alayhim ajma'een. 